here in Fredericksburg, Virginia, and I'm here in downtown at the corner of William and Sophia Street, and here's a plaque where it says, here Frederick Fredericksburg began. The lease land, John Buckner and Thomas Royston, the first settlers, May 2nd, 1671. It's on this it's on this rock right here and this is what the this corner looks like there's an old stole building we'll go over there and look at it and here's a bridge across the Rappahannock River here is the old stone warehouse look how old this building is Let's go find out, uh, oh, here we go. Stone Warehouse, circa 1813, built by Thomas Goodwin, Patriot. Here we have a mural of Fredericksburg, established 1728. All right, I'm at the corner of Caroline and Charlotte Streets. And you can see some of the, the old buildings here in the shopping district. This is Caroline Street. It goes down for blocks of restaurants, shops. And then here is the visitor center where you can go in and they'll help you out to find uh, everything you need to know about Fredericksburg. Here at the uh, visitor center, there's a plaque here called it says Fredericksburg Civil War Sites. Uh, for 18 months, Fredericksburg was at the heart of the Civil War. Union and Confederate soldiers camped here, fought here, and died here. Today, there are many sites within the city. Civil War walking tour information is available at the visitor center. So here we see uh, the Rappahannock River. Here they have another sign. It says. Fredericksburg where 100,000 fell because of the immense amount of fighting that occurred here the Fredericksburg area has been called the vortex of the Civil War four major battles uh, Fredericksburg Chancellorsville Wilderness and Sponsylvania Courthouse resulted in approximately 100,000 casualties we're heading west on Caroline Street it's a one way and show you some more of the shops Blocks and blocks. I'm on the corner of Hanover and Charles. It's part of the historic district. And check out these historic houses. They're all over Fredericksburg. I had to stop and just show you a few of them. They still look, and they're still dressed up like the, the way they were a long time ago. Look at that. Okay, we're crossing the Rappahannock River. We're leaving the city of Fredericksburg and entering Stafford County. And we're going to go check out the boyhood home of George Washington. Okay, here's the location of the George Washington's childhood home. The Washington family moved to a plantation here in 1738 when George was six years old. Along with his three brothers and sister, young Washington spent most of his early life here where according to popular fable, he cut down his father's cherry tree and uttered the immortal words, I cannot tell a lie. His father Augustine died here in 1743 leaving the property to him. His mother, Mary Ball Washington, lived here until 1772 when she moved to a house in Fredericksburg that Washington bought for her. And here, they say, is the replica. 
of the original house. So there's what it should have looked like, closely anyway. And this is the part of the plantation. They said uh, it stretched across the highway behind me even more.